we have a huge bit of toys to go through tonight. And if you're asking where I got it, it is a long story. So we went to a Goodwill outlet not that long ago in Charlotte, North Carolina. And while I was digging through the many, 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 many bins of toys, actually, no, it wasn't toys. I was digging through clothes. My husband was digging through on the toys and he found an entire bucket. So I was too busy trying to like get cute stuff for winter and like pick out stuff for my son. And then all of a sudden I see my husband with like Halloween buckets and a big old box of toys. So I haven't looked through it yet. I'm really excited to see what's in here. So let's dig in. Um, so I'm just going to leave it kind of on my chair and dig through because I am not about to pull it up here. So I'm just going to stab the plastic. And the cool thing is um, with these Goodwill outlets, things are so affordable. Like I was not physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually prepared for what that was going to put me through because they sell clothes. It's like a dollar sixty something per pound. Like and you just get these rolly bins and just put stuff in it and it's crazy and I think I actually might have some footage of me like before during and after this whole ordeal I was sweaty I was tired it was a mess but like there's a link above that will probably you know show you all that disaster um that was Goodwill Outlet like those people were serious. Like, they make this their job. They go there, they get stuff, they flip it. I was just trying to find cute stuff, but my husband found all the cute toys. I found some cute place mats, but by the time I left, I literally felt like I ran a marathon. Like, I felt like I worked out. And this is literally just tape. Like, I thought this was like some kind of plastic around here, but no, they taped this bin up. And it was just sitting in the corner of the store. And my husband thought, like, maybe they're holding it for somebody. But apparently not. It is for us. And um, it's for us to go through. And my son's been looking at it. Like, when are you going to open it, Mommy? Um, so we're going to open it, clean it, and, you know, give them all the goodies. So, all right. Now that I am covered in sticky tape, this is neat, right? So this is, like, a dinosaur alligator, some kind of car it's got a turn on off switch which is neat it's in the on, on position so it may may not work um either way it's really cool my son's gonna enjoy pushing it around it looks like it might have a remote no it doesn't have a remote control it really doesn't um but that's kind of cool and he's gonna like it because it's dinosaur reptile alligator related so he's gonna think that's pretty neat so gonna definitely clean that up and he's probably gonna ride that all around the house so that's the first thing and there's like a lot of big chunky things in here um like this oh my goodness um i didn't know this was gonna need two hands and it's kind of stuck to the tape look at this <laughs> like seriously like, <laughs> what, what do we need this for there's no necessity of this in our house like so apparently the hulk jack uh um, a Hydra vehicle and he's smashing his way. Oh, that's neat. Okay. So yeah, I mean, obviously it's some kind of motorized something or other, but he's got batteries in his back. So I'm going to check those out and maybe clean it up, but this is so unnecessary. Like, I don't know what to do with this. Um, my husband will probably love it. My son loves the Hulk. Um, I think that was the first superhero that he recognized. Um, that was the first one, and then it went to Spider-Man, and um, then it went to Iron Man, and then I got really jealous, and I taught him Batman, um, and he's got Batman down, but I was just like, you need to learn some DC. All right, so um, hmm, this is a spinning blade dinosaur missing his legs, and um, it looks like it's, I, you know what, I don't even know. I'm not even going to try and guess what that is. It's a blade saw dinosaur with no black back legs, and it looks like it shoots something out the top. So that's a dinosaur. So my son will love it. But weird, right? Like, and, and the cool thing is, I don't know what it is, but then I'll go and I'll Google it later. And then so I just may be like, hey, um, this, is, this is what it is. This is what it could be. So I don't know. I'll find out. Looks like maybe he beat some stuff with his tail. I don't know. I'll find some markings later. That's that's insane. 
we got a um, plushy narwhal, right? Because, because. Um, we've got a Soldier Force motorcycle. Okay, that's neat. Like, I, I guess if you guys want to see. So we got a little kickstand fancy. There you go. Um, what is the theme of motorcycles here, I wonder? Like, what is this? Like, I don't think we need this, but this looks like a... Uh, it's got, like, megahertz and stuff, so this actually might be, like, a remote control one. Oh. So, there's another motorcycle. Um, we got a gun. We got, um, you know, a little Nerf gun. We have so many. We actually have these Nerf discs. We have so many Nerf everything. We have an entire chest full of Nerf. Um, so, this will be put up for when he is older. He's definitely not getting that now. Um, we've got a skunk. It's just like the randomness of it just gets me sometimes. Um, it's like motorcycle, motorcycle, skunk. This looks like a Pokemon. Um, I'm not familiar with this one, but he's got cute little action. This looks like a McDonald's toy almost. I don't know. I can't really see. It, it's kind of it's kind of dark. But we got a Pokemon. Okay, so this is recent. This is um, these are one of the McDonald's. Oh, and it still lights up. These are the McDonald's toys ones, so it's kind of neat. Um, let me see. We got a boulder and uh, it's a mix of dinosaurs. So we got like, look at the little dinosaur head he has. This is so weird. Like, take a look at this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to clear this stuff off. He's got the littlest dinosaur head. He's got a dinosaur with a drill bit back here. Bandai. Oh, okay. That, that makes sense. <laughs> So yeah, that's a that's a whole thing right there. So that's neat. Um, we got a car. Um, that's cool. Here, I want to spin him around so you can kind of see what he looks like. Right there. Um, we've got a really bu really busted. Somebody eat this? It looks like a dog got to it. To be honest with you, it's. I'm just gonna trash that. But um, we got oh some Lightning McQueens. He's gonna be happy. Add this to his collection. Um. We got a Groot and a whole entire filled bubble wand. That's cool. This is so random. This is what I love. Um, mm, it's a car ramp. Ain't that cute? It looks like it might go to like a play school, like a play set kind of thing, but that's kind of neat. Um, oh, look it. And it's in such good shape too. It's actually like really nice. Uh, my son's not going to know what to do with this. He's never seen a rotary phone. He, he's just going to be completely clueless. But that's a flashback. Um, my toddlers actually have two of these in the classroom, and they don't play with it. They play with the, the phone. It's like It looks like a cell phone, and it looks like a tablet, and it does like a bunch of stuff, like does the ABCs and stuff. If there's like no screen. It just you hit buttons. They play with that, but they won't play with the phone. So, I don't know. Um, a baby toy, which I might just donate to my school. Um, so I'll go down there. Um, this is like metal, so that's kind of neat. Um, this is a Porsche. Funny story. No, not really. I'm not getting into that story. Um, <laughs> Porsches. I don't do Porsches. Um, this is from a Disney movie. This looks like, um, you know, like one of those little night things, like from those little play sets. Oh, we have one of these. This is a Grimlock. Um, and I think we have one open and sealed because, you know, that's how we do things. Um, oh, we got like a Jurassic World type thingy. I was like, where's his arms? But, you know. Um, and this is kind of neat. This is a pretty one. I think he's actually going to like that. This is a big Hot Wheels one, so... This is like all for my son. He's going to have a blast. So we got another bubble wand. This one's not as full. So I don't know what happened there. Um, oh, we got a Snoopy, the Red Baron. So cute. Um, oh, this is from Guardians of the Galaxy. We got a baby Jack Jack. Um, this is from Rio, which I think he actually liked that movie. Oh, she lights up. That's different. That's a, oops. <laughs> Husband's behind the camera, like freaking out about the lights in his eyes. All right, so we got um, another monster truck. He is gonna have a blast. It's gonna be like Christmas for him. Um, this is one of those, you know, remote control thingies, which I'm 
probably not gonna keep, so I'm just gonna put that in the pile down there. <gasps> Look, we got matching narwhals. I think these were, they're Beanie Babies, so they're probably like a McDonald's toy shape thing. Um, we got a chest of bananas. That's always good. Um, ooh, this is a nice one. This is a Spidey one. Oh, I like it. Um, you can put, it's got an on button, so it's gonna do stuff. Um, so I'm actually kind of excited to see what this does if and we get it to work. That was really southern. I said if and we get it to work, but that's fine. They're everywhere. Um, looks like it's kind of broken, but I'm still going to see what it does. I, you know, I want to see if it works. See, you know. I feel like I've seen this before. This is like to some kind of like rescue set, I think. Um, so that'll be fun. This one looks like it's like from those little people ones. This no, is VTAC apparently. So this is just, you know, his little guys will be able to ride it. He has so many Imaginex. Um, yeah, there's this, which is cool. He's, he's gonna like that. Um, we got another Jurassic World. We've got a newer Lion King. I'm just curious why, why it's making that noise. I'll figure that out later. Um, we got a gun. I never had toys like this, so I'm going to keep this for me. <laughs> um, that was kind of fun. All right. Um, we have some kind of hover vehicle of some sorts. We have another Spidey motorcycle. This one's kind of in better shape. Um, cute. Spidey motorcycle. Um, we got a Doctor Strange. We've got a muff looking thing got exhaust pipe I don't know whatever um oh this is from Gru that oh I just broke everything this is from that Gru movie so that's kind of strange. um no I don't know I don't know knows more I don't know I want to say it's from like some kind of Disney movie because this is definitely a McDonald's toy but I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm not as up on my Disney movies as I should be. This is just a regular Kawasaki. So, um, oh, this is a baby toy. This is like a rocking, a rocking Elmo thing. Um, yeah. Ooh, it's an alligator. It just looks like it's from a board game because it's got like a little spinny thing on here and some batteries. So it might like try and get you kind of thing. Um, so who knows what that's, that, that's about. All right. Um, another Madagascar toy. This is, um, it looks like a Skylander. Um, it's like McDonald's toy, which is kind of cool. Ooh, a flashlight. It doesn't work. I decided to put it down just in case. It doesn't work. So keep that. Get some batteries in it. Oh, we got a little Tykes hammer does not work. We have one that works, so I'm not that worried about it. So this might get donated too. We'll put that down the aisle. We've got a guy that probably goes on any one of these vehicles. Could be anyone. Who knows? For now, he's going to go on the Spidey one, maybe. Cool. Um, gross. It's a nose syringe. Gross. Trash. <laughs> I don't do snot. Um, a terrible Power Ranger. Um, a skateboard for what looks like Paw Patrol. This is, God, who does the recycling? I want to say Zuma. Um, or is it Rocky? I don't remember. Zuma, it's Rocky. So this is his, it looks like his little skateboard. If there's a Rocky in here, that'd be kind of cool. Uh, we got another Skylander. Um, like a little hammer piece. Oh, we got a Beast Boy. That's kind of neat. Hang out, buddy. And that's from, um, King Titan. So that's cool. Um, oh, okay, okay, I like it, this is a thing, I can wear this, it actually really doesn't fit, but that's cool, I didn't even get to see what kind of transformer it was, but all I saw was the transformer symbol on the front, so this is, this is kind of cool, I like it, um, oh, neat, um, we got a meerkat, and a little piece of a Tonka, um, we got some Incredibles action figures. This guy's neat. He's a clicker clacker thing, I think. Um, but he's cool. Look at him. Awesome. Um, we got a motorcycle. A very weird piece. There we go. I don't know. 
Um, this is kind of cute. This little tracker thingy. Um, this is some kind of flying vehicle. I want to say it's from Star Wars. No, I don't know. Um, we got a Mickey Mouse. Mario. We got a Mario Rubik's Cube. Um, some kind of play set accessory. A very chewed, very chewed, um, car thing. We got a little transformer. Oh, look, he's kind of cute. I can't. Oh, there you go. There you go. He's cute. Um, a flag. Can't go wrong with a flag. We've got a Hummer. Um, this is very metal-y. So that's kind of neat. This is like the metal stuff I really don't want to give him because he still clangs a bunch of stuff. This is so broken. Um, so I think that's going to go in the trash pile. He's eaten. Like, eaten. Like, what happened to you? I want to know your life story. He is just... I want to say dog. There's no way human did this. It's everywhere. Like, check out his feet. Like, that has to be an animal. If not, someone was really teething. Get this kid a teething ring. Oh, my goodness. All right. Um, um, uh, Mike. This is Mike. Oh, I got a surf. Cute. That's, um, I think I'm a McDonald's toy as well. We got a minion. I don't like minions. I'm just going to go out there and say it. I don't like minions. That's okay. Um, this is probably another little VTech thing. So that's cool. Um, a ladybug. A ladybug on a mushroom. Just in case. Oh, that's what this is for. Oh, Mike did make it. It's all right. It was a funny microphone anyway. And then we got another Beanie Baby. This one's kind of cute. And then I swear I really got like a couple more things left. Um, this looks like some kind of motorcycle guy. And this looks like it's from Kung Fu Panda or something. This Mantis. So it's kind of neat. He's got like... <laughs> I don't know why that amuses me as much as it does, but that's pretty neat. Um... We've got a Sandy Beach Resort bracelet and um, a little pink and black motorcycle with some fairies on it. Um, Lotso, he's kind of cute. He's going to be mine. He's going up to my office. And last but not least, a tiger for our. Well, that's a lot of stuff, guys. Um, and like this bin was I want to say like under five dollars so this was a lot of stuff um that hulk alone man that's some that's some stuff so all this is going to get as cleaned as it can like you know we can't really dunk the electrical stuff but we're going to clean most of it son's going to get like 90 percent of this so he's going to have a blast all right guys I'll see you next video bye hello everyone so we've reached one of our first few milestones we've got to 100 subscribers we got to 125 so this one is our new one for 150 and i just wanted to take the time to thank you guys for watching these videos i mean the whole reason we got into it was because it was just fun whenever we my husband would buy things i would open them and the looks on my face when he when i opened them were priceless and he kind of wanted to catch it on camera and all the comments that I make, like, really, another one of these. So, it just started off as a joke between him and I. And it kind of just grew. I mean, I love toys. And I can't go anywhere without looking for toys. I have a toy, like, six cents every time I go into a store. So, I'm really glad that you guys have shared this journey with me. And so, now we have a new milestone. 150 subscribers. And once we get to 150, I would love to do another raffle since the first one went so well. And we had a lot of participants. So I kind of wanted to give you guys some choices. Uh, the first one, we just decided to give away a Skeletor. But, you know, we do other toys also on JetX Toy Box. So I wanted to give you the choices. So we have this guy. Um, so this is a Marvel Legends, and it's really cool. It's one of the Build-A-Figs, and, you know, this is kind of the only one that we're giving away from the Build-A-Fig, but it's kind of cool, right? Um, so we're thinking about giving away Mr. Wonder Man. 
Um, let me know what you think. Let me know if you're interested. He's one of our options. And he's new in box. Really cool, right? We've got multiple arms. Apparently, marked the hands, apparently. And you get an abomination leg. Cool. Or, this is one of our newest acquisitions. Um, the metal head from TMNT Pop. We got some turtle fans out there. Um, I was thinking maybe if you were interested, you might want to get the metal head. And this is a Target exclusive, by the way. So just in case you haven't seen it out in stores, it's because it's a Target exclusive. Or it wouldn't be a Gen X raffle if we didn't at least offer a He-Man. So as you can see, we have a boxed figure and we brought him out. We've got a Prince Adam for you. This is the Super 7 Filmation version. Um, so this is also one of the prizes that you can pick from. So um, I'm trying to figure out how I want to do it. I'm trying to decide whether, you know, we just pick the winner and the winner gets to choose their prize or if we get enough requests we'll just make the raffle that prize i think i might make it winner's choice this time um yeah and i think we'll probably do it the same way by looking at who has commented on our page and assigning them a number so once we get to 150 please make sure you comment comment on the videos and whoever has commented you will get assigned a number and then we'll do the random number generator again and then we'll find a winner and then we'll hopefully get that video up and if you could take a video of yourself opening the prize so we can see if you liked it or not all right so let's get to our next goal 150 subscribers you think you can do it I think we can do it. Get some more people, get some friends, because I'm excited to give these away. See you guys soon.